Okay, we're going to do a, a show here on 13139 Zori Lane. This is obviously the street view. Um, it's a nice street, nice neighborhood. Look at this big guy directly across the street, three bedroom. This is a, there's a lake over there, so houses here will be on this side. Usually a little bit nicer and bigger because they're lake. But these houses are nice, built in 04. This one's 2,700 feet, a 43 asking 260, a two car garage. Uh, it's got a, a fenced backyard, but I'll just show you over here. That's the side yard. There's not a lot of room between these homes, any of these homes built in the 2000s. So it's got a nice brick driveway. It does not have gutters. I don't know that it needs gutters. It's been here for seven years without them. And here's the side yard. Let's look at some of the appliances. I don't know what this is. Maybe a water treatment. Um, and we've got a condenser here, Puron. That means it's a kind of newer, high tech. And you see we're fenced here. All right, we'll pick up again when I will enter and do the interior. This is a continuation of 13139 Zori. And let's have a look at the inside of this place, okay? And we're here at this front porch that we saw earlier. So, one of the things I like about this place is there's a lot of tile, which is great for rentals. It's great for a lot of things. So this has got a nice bunch of room here. Here's a, a dining room area. Can you please close the door? Thank you. Um, and we've got some fixtures here, which is good that they're here. The place is in pretty good shape. It's a four bedroom, three bath, 2,700 feet, asking 260,000. It's been on the market for five days. I don't think it'll last too long. Okay, this is the linen or the like coat closet looking back to the front door. We've got crown molding. We have a tray ceiling up there. Nice and bright in here. <clears throat> now as we come into here, this is be like the great room. Oftentimes people turn it into the TV room. It's got a nice tall ceiling. It's got recessed lighting. It does not have crown molding in here. <clears throat> Access to a screened porch right there. And here is the kitchen. So it's a nice big long, I think it's called a galley kitchen with recessed lighting, knock down ceilings. Uh, it's got its appliances and it's got a, uh, well, just about a walk in um, pantry here. The cabinets, they look like nice cabinets. I don't see any scratches or anything. There's hard surface. This is, I don't know what it is, but it's likely a Corian product. Uh, I would call it that double sink. So <clears throat> this is the view obviously from the kitchen. So let's come on over here and look at the master, which is straight through here. It's tucked away nicely. It's got a little hallway. And this is not the master bath. It's kind of like the guest bath, which also goes on the other side to a hallway. I'll show you that in a minute. The flooring in here is nice. I don't know if it's real wood, but it looks very nice. Uh, and it's in the, uh, most of the bedrooms, which is also nice because I know I'm using nice a lot, but carpet, we want to try to avoid that when we can. Okay, so the master's got a tray ceiling and um, um, lots of light and it's got these doors that lead to the outside, of course. Um, so here's the master bath. I know I'm losing my focus here. So it's got a garden tub, we call it, nice and bright. <coughs> oh, excuse me, a walk-in closet, nice and big, needs some paint. Shower needs a little caulk. And I'm walking fast now because my battery is leaving us. So let's come on over here and look at one of these bedrooms, because I said it's a four bedroom. So this is at the front of the house, the same wood floor as we were talking about. This is a, it's a nice, nice bedroom. Here's a full bath. This could be a guest bath. And when I come over here, I see the garage. The garage is nice and clean. The floor has been painted. It's got the uh, door opener control. We've got a uh, laundry room here with washer and dryer. And coming down here, we've got two more. So this would be bedroom three. Same flooring, same tall ceilings. Same nice shape. 
and bedroom number four. Again, same nice flooring, but nice, nice and roomy. And here we are into this, uh, this Jack and Jill kind of a uh, bathroom, but it's a full bath. So there's three full bathrooms here. Let's run outside real quickly. Okay, so we've got a walled-in backyard, fenced. A lot of people like fenced. So that's going to be it for now. This is a nice house. It'll probably go for 265, 270 is what I'd be thinking, um, and it'll probably sell soon. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this.